to Virginia This Morning. Yeah, every season brings new trends. Well, this year, mink snails, M-I-N-X, mink snails have become the latest must-have fashion accessories for celebrities. Yeah, you don't have to be Beyonce or Rihanna to sport these nails, though. Jen Stafford from Mango Salon shows us how easy and long-lasting these new fashion statements are. And we want to say hello to Brittany as well. Nice to see you, ladies. Good morning. Hey, Jennifer, tell us, what are mink snails and why are they becoming so popular on the red carpet? Uh, mink snails are uh, sort of a decal with an adhesive, and you can put them on natural nails. And I think they appeal to women for these is that you can have you know wild patterns and bold prints and metallic finishes without you know going to the lengths of getting acrylics on your nails. So these are meant for natural nails not for acrylics? Right. Okay and how long would they last? They last longer than your typical polish. Um, it depends you know on your lifestyle, if you're going to be in water constantly, you might just want to pay t closer attention to them. Um, any any kind of wear that you would see can be easily fixed with applying heat with a, with a hair dryer and uh, just pressing it right back down. Are now, there course, endless designs on these as well, Jen? Pretty much, yes. yes I say, <laughs> what we were looking at is, is we've got the different styles and different colors, and Brittany was telling me that the two on her opposite ends are the most popular. The thumb, which has got um, the leopard print, and then the silver nail. Look at that. Very nice. So tell us about the process to apply these. Um, it's it's pretty much just you use a heat lamp. Um, the, it softens the decal that you put on there. Uh, the heat softens the adhesive and it forms to your nail and it cools and you just file off the excess and it just the product just lasts. Sounds like it's uh, sort of mess free too, Jen. Absolutely. There's no drying time. You can just pick up your keys and go when it's over. So there's no worrying about buckling your seatbelt when you get in your car after your manicure or anything <laughs> like that. Now, any woman who's ever had acrylic nails knows that when you want to take them off, a lot of times that your nails underneath are damaged. Do you have that issue with these? Not at all. You just apply heat from, you know, warm water or a hair dryer and peel it off slowly from one side to the next. If anything, there might be a little bit of sticky residue from the, the, the adhesive, but you just take a little rubbing alcohol, it comes right off. Your nails mm -hmm. are just fine underneath. And it's also environmentally friendly as well, right? It's uh, less uh, uh, damaging to the uh, environment as opposed to some of the nail polishes that we have as well. Well, there's no fumes, that's for sure, mm -hmm. um, and, and you definitely use less. I mean, there's no liquid polish that you need to, like, dispose of or anything like that. So. Now, it seems to me that since it is a cover on your nail, if you have problems with breaking nails or you bite your nails or something like that, that might be a good deterrent or it might help your nails to grow a little bit? Absolutely, especially if they're, you know, brittle or they tend to peel. They also make a clear, um, what they call, minx nail armor that you can apply. So it just kind of holds everything together. It's a little layer of reinforcement, so. Mm -hmm. What are we talking price-wise, Jen? Uh, it's about $10 on top of the average um, price for, for the normal manicure or pedicure. Uh, $45 for a manicure and uh, $70 for pedicure. Also, we do provide express pedicure, so that would be $55. So like $10 for a full set of nails on top of a manicure? Right, pedicure? correct. Not 10 per. Right, exactly, <laughs> yes. Just it's an additional checking. $10. Now, you've been wearing this for a while. What's the response people give you when they see your nails? Well, they have lots of questions as to how they stay on, how they get on, um, but I mean, they're really attention getters, especially the um, the metallic and definitely the animal print. Mm -hmm. uh, but this one's nice too. I feel like you can just kind of have like a sleek, nice polished look. This one actually has a pink little hint to it. Oh, What's see, I thought on? you just had one that wasn't done, so that, yeah. that's actually a natural <laughs> color that you can get. Yeah. Conservative. People love them. Yeah. We've got a little heat lamp right here. Let's see um, how the process is done right now. Okay. And I'm just going to take our hand right under here. Warm the process up isn't really that it. long, Jen, right? No, it takes, you know, little, just a couple seconds. And we just peel this off, hold it under the heat. I guess the big decision is really determining what design you want. Uh, absolutely. That can be quite time consuming. And this is not a nail <laughs> lengthening process, though, because no. you're going to take the decal and, and take it to the length of the actual nail. Absolutely. There's, there's no lengthening. Because right now she looks like a dragon lady, but that's going to be cut down. <laughs> right. And then you just apply it like that. Just apply a lot of pressure to make sure it's fully adhered. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, normally you, you kind of place it under there to attach it to the end of her nail while you do the rest of her nails. Mm -hmm. But for right now, we'll go ahead and just take it and you file it right off. Now, is this strictly a salon product, or is this something people will eventually be able to get at home? Um, you can only purchase these decals if you're a licensed nail technician okay. or cosmetologist. So you have to go get let the experts do it for Absolutely. you. Absolutely. And it is. It's quick and easy and not painful because it's basically like just getting your, your nails filed, right? Right. right. And then yeah. just kind of go over the tips a little bit, smooth it out. And I don't have my, my scissors. You usually use a little pair of 
sharp uh, needle nose scissors to kind of trim any excess, but mm -hmm. just as a... So that they look point. very manicured. Right. And no couple, mess. No mess. No mess. So they're called mink snails, M-I-N-X. So don't go and ask for like mink coat nails, <laughs> but this will be so you can be a little minx. <laughs> Thank well, you, Jennifer, ladies, for thank in. you so much. Thank you very much. us on the edge of fashion. I like that. <laughs> Looking good on the red carpet. Yeah. All right, we're going to see if uh, that uh, cloudy temperatures, I should say the cloudy... Uh, well, I guess what we had some rain last night. Yeah, see that the, the sunshine's going to be returning for the weekend. That would be nice, Gary. Yeah. yeah, that's right. We are going to see a decrease in cloud cover right now. We're looking at a live shot out at the airport where the current temperature is 51 degrees, but you can.